OBS is a free and easy software to help you manage a live stream. In this video, we will set up a main gaming scene and go over basic settings for a Twitch stream. For more in-depth details on OBS, see our video, How to Use OBS. Link is in the description below. Let's open OBS. Click the plus sign to create a new scene, then label it. We will call it Gaming Scene. Now we need to add sources to this scene. Inside the source box, click the plus sign, then Display Capture. Make sure Create New is selected, label it, and hit OK. If you're using dual monitors, make sure to choose the one you're actually gaming on, then hit OK. Now you need to connect your mic. In Sources, click the plus button. Click Audio Input Capture. Make sure Create New is selected, then OK. Now select your device and click OK. In your audio mixer window, you can see a mic level and desktop audio level. Under each one is a slider. You can use it to adjust the volume. Now let's add a webcam. In Sources, click the plus button. Then Video Capture Device. Select your webcam source and hit OK. You can adjust the size and placement of the webcam right on the screen. Now that your basic gaming scene is set up, let's connect OBS to Twitch to start streaming. Click Settings, then go to Stream. Here you will enter your stream key from Twitch. Remember, do not share your stream key with anyone. To obtain your stream key, go to twitch.tv, then click on your profile in the top right, then go to your creator dashboard. On the left, click Settings, then Stream. Now copy your stream key and paste it into OBS and hit OK. Let's look at a couple settings you can adjust to optimize your stream inside OBS. Inside your settings, go to Output, then make sure your video bitrate is set to 6,000 kilobytes per second and your encoder is set to hardware, if available. Also turn off any advanced encoder settings. I suggest doing a speed test on your internet connection to make sure you have enough upload bandwidth. Google search speed test, then run the speed test right on the page. You should have at least 7,000 kilobytes per second of upload available to manage a 6,000 kilobytes per second upload stream. You can now click Start Stream on the bottom right inside OBS and you will automatically go live on Twitch. Thank you.